Hi traders, Niall here from LearnToTradeTheMarket.com. Welcome to today's Forex trading video. Now we've had some interesting activity on the Aussie dollar. Today I've got up the Aussie dollar cross rate on the daily time frame. I'm looking at the New York close. Now this doesn't include the Sunday trading session as a single bar. It includes a Sunday and Monday session as a one full candlestick. So just to recap there we're using New York closed charts and a lot of people ask me why my charts are different I've been trading this way for almost uh, eight years now and I think New York closed are a superior trading tool and uh, for those using GMT charts I think if you move over to the New York closed uh, time frame you're certainly going to be seeing some of the signals that I'm looking at so just to uh, answer some of the questions I've been getting on the email that would uh, certainly explain a lot of the problems that you're having trying to find these signals that I talk about. Alright, so let's look at today's setup that I've found on the Aussie dollar. Obviously this has already happened. It's an after the event hindsight example. Uh, any information here is obviously just education, not trading advice. I think it's probably too late to be getting onto this one anyway. But uh, we'll have a look at it. It's a daily pin bar reversal with a 50% tweak entry. We've got a nice uptrend here. It's a pretty obvious trade actually. I thought I'd just throw the camera on and talk about it. We've got this uptrend line which is very obvious. If I take the chart in and zoom in you'll uh, quickly see the signal that I'm talking about. It's one of these famous pin bar reversals that I keep talking about. It's a very, very uh, accurate reversal indication. Uh, we had one here and we've also seen uh, one in here it was an inside bar pin bar and we've also seen one here so three setups have been profitable here all with the trend of course I advise uh, beginner traders to trade with the trend only you can see that this recent setup here is quite a powerful false break we had a, a false break of the trend line a false break is simply when you have a key level in the market which uh, is broken and then we could quickly uh, shimmy back up and reclaim that level so you can see this false break signal here very powerful and the market opened up on Monday quite weak in fact and we moved down to the 50% area of this candle it's not Fibonacci okay it's a simple balance point of the range of uh, Friday so we moved down here and then have started to move up through the highs of Friday. So that's a bullish setup, one of the proprietary setups I talk about in the trading course and certainly uh, one of those setups, it's a bread and butter setup obviously you'll be taking these quite often on the daily charts and when they appear as a false break signal against a trend line or a moving average or a support level they're extremely uh, profitable and you can just see how profitable they are. We'll look at the previous example you'll notice this right here on the trend line this pin bar right here resulted in quite a significant up move this one in here another significant up move. Now, I'm not saying this one's going to take out these highs but it certainly looks quite bullish if you were to get long here your stop loss could be below that low I'm not sure how wide that is, it's quite tight but your target would be simply a measure of your stop loss placement. Another way is to actually expand the range of Friday's candle so if you're using the range of this bar, let's say it's 150 points, we might look at two times that range. From the entry here, we could look for 300 points of upside, which would be what, 91, uh, let's say up towards 93. So somewhere in here could be the exit point. I'm not sure if it's going to get there, but obviously got to take the setups as they uh, unfold. So that was just a, a quick video on the pin bar reversal buy setup on the Aussie dollar using the 50% tweaked entry obviously an advanced price action strategy that most uh, overlook in the market but a very profitable one that I've used for years and uh, as I said in the last video I've revamped a lot of the course content 100 new pages trying to focus on uh, that whole start to finish from beginner to advanced I'm really going to be improving that over the uh, Christmas period and I should be launching up to 20 new uh, tutorial videos that explain all the stuff in depth. I think the first time round I did well but I want to really improve on that and of course members get a free upgrade there. It's all included lifetime membership. Anyway that's all I've got to say today. I'll see you in the next video uh, which will be probably about 10 days uh, away and uh, for those members that have just joined up welcome aboard. Take care. See you in the next video.